Hey there, Dwarf Sparrows here, and today we have another Wi-Fi battle. Ooh, the Tapu Koko, we might be able to finally use our Amolga. Uh, this is our last battle with our Amolga team. We're gonna lead with our Primarina. His team is just, oh, all sorts of nasty. He's got that Toxapex core, and two Tapus and a Fermosa. Like, this is really kind of, unfortunately, powerful oh all right well it was a good run while we had it with our Molga team oh all right we found our, our opponent jink uh also known as gold we found him on our uh discord server oh not our discord server the pokemon battle discord server there's that electric terrain. Now here's my favorite bit. Here's my favorite bit. Going to Sugar Sticks. He just goes T-Bolt straight away. Love it. Now... The way he's playing his Tapu Koko, and based off the rest of his team, I do feel like he's choice. I hope so. Um, because we kind of need our Amolga to take care of it. <sighs> right now. I'm just gonna go for a hidden power. We lose Sugar Sticks, we lose Sugar Sticks, but I don't think, oh, he's staying in. We lose Sugar Sticks. No, no. He hidden power ice? Okay. So we can we can actually take out Cap Tapu Coco now. Um, let's do it. Let's let's take out his Tapu Coco. He's probably gonna switch out. Yeah, he wants to keep his Tapu Coco around, which is fair enough. Oh, it's so tempting. It is so absolutely tempting to go for a. Uh, Gigavolt Havoc on this thing. But, we're just gonna... Baton Pass. Into Rhapsody. There we go. Let me look at the calc real quick. So we can take a look at this. That's to be expected. It's gonna be a we should be a two hit KO against Celestelia. With our pre marina. Hydro pump. I believe that's not what I'm talking right now. Uh, let me do that in the modest. See how much damage this does. I have a good feeling about it. Yes, yeah, the two hit KO. He toxics us, but that's fine. We put a huge dent in his walls, which is awesome. Oh, there's that Amolga. Now. Something tells me he's going to just protect here, because he it doesn't seem like he's running that. His sets don't seem that special. So if he's going to protect, I'm going to go to Sugar Sticks. We lose Sugar Sticks, we lose Sugar Sticks. If not, it's fine. I really don't think so. I think so still he's, he's just going to go for a protect, yeah. It's so freaking predictable, dude. Come on. We need we need predictability though with his sets. 
All right. Um, I think he's going to go into his Marowak. That's what I would do. Let's do it. You guys have already seen Gigavolt have it from my Amolga anyways, so. There we go. Nice prediction. It's story time, guys. Okay. Now, we want to keep Sugar Sticks around. And then I'm just gonna... Baton Pass. Boom. Mm, the question is, Primarina speed versus Marowak speed. What's your base speed? 45 versus 60. He's gonna go for a Shadow Bone. Or a Flare Blitz. We're gonna go into Heartbleed. I don't really care about the Shadow Bone. Yeah. Nice and red! We're gonna go for a Shadow Ball here. Hopefully we'll bring Marowak down a bit. I'm so glad we gotta use Amolga! Amolga did his job! If I went for Gigavolt Havoc there, we would have gotten rid of Silstelia too. Oh, great. Is he gonna go straight for a kill? I don't think anything bad happens if we go over the peekaboo here. Even if we break, he breaks her disguise. That's fine. Peekaboo is kind of the okay. Yeah. Oh man, this is just. I feel like a freaking psychic right now. Oof. Goes into his Tapu Koko. Tapu Koko, what do you have for me? He should go for Dazzling Gleam. Because I don't think he's going to go, he's going to make the same mistake and let Amolga get the speed up again. What is Mimikyu versus Tepu Coco? Tepu Coco. It's a Shadow Sneak. Can't wait till all the. That's two. It's about 50. Okay, awesome. Yeah, so I'm going to Sword Stance here. Goes for the T-Bolt. Dude. Oh, he paralyzes us. That's not good. Oh, that's bad. New sword stance. Still gonna go for the Shadow Sneak. We got our swords. It's a little sad that we are we're paralyzed, but we got our swords up. Mm. Yes! We break through that para. And we're able to kill the Tapu Coco. Nice and clean. Oh, we also have the life orb. Which is gonna help us quite a bit. I can't, I, I think I just said it, but I can't wait for these calcs to have sets already applied to them. Because it's such a pain to like go through and add everything yourself. Uh, Jolly Mimikyu, for that matters. 
I need a life orb. Right. I okay. Against Marowak, I think we're good. Do we lose connection? Okay, we didn't lose connection. Alright, we're gonna go for a Shadow Sneak. Yeah, someone's making noise. I don't know what it is. Don't be my internet. If I lose connection, I am going to be so upset. All right, there we go. We got our, we got a shadow sneak off. Bye, bye, Marowak. I, I feel so good to just get rid of this core. This core is the bane of my existence. Toxapex, Celestia, Marowak. It's so good. I, I'm just so annoyed by it. I can't deal with it. Absolutely cannot deal with it. We're gonna go for a shadow claw here. Feels good to start taking it out. And we can get a free Gigavolt Havoc now that we don't have. I mean, I think Peekaboo might actually be able to kill everything. Boom, ba doom, ba da da boom, ba doom, ba doom, ba doom, boom, boom, ba doom, ba da da boom, 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 ba ding, boom. Professor Amolga in the house. Our Pikachu clones are putting in so much work this match. Bye bye, Peekaboo. I kind of want Peekaboo just to go down. Should I preserve the 6 0? Nah. Nah. What's that? Tapu Bulu? We can Tapu Bulu. Tapu Bulu can't take Kartana. So we should be alright. We should be okay. <sighs> There's the para. It's okay. Oh, I'm just so proud of you. So proud of you! Mostly proud of that Emolga though, because that Emolga put in work! And I think Emolga is also faster than Tapu Bulu. Well, I haven't taken out Celestilia yet. So I, should, I shouldn't count my chickens before they hatch, because I might be able to get Toxic stalled. <sighs> under the right circumstances. So I'm just going to go for a T-Bolt here. If he wants to go into his Tapu Bulu, which is what I would probably do uh, to get some Regenerator back. Nope. He's just resigned to, to take the damage. Taking the damage. We should be able to clean up now. You guys want to see me do the Gigavolt Havoc Z-Move? See if I perfect this? Tapu Bulu, you want to take a Z move? Do it. Let's do it. Emolga. Hashtag Emolga, guys. Put down hashtag Emolga in the comments. I want to hear a rallying cry for our star player. Oh, so happy. Here we go. Give all havoc time, guys. Look at how angry Yamoga looks. It's just. Oh. Yeah, that did about as much as I was expecting to do. Wood hammer. Mm -hmm. Go for the recoil. And now we're gonna let Cartana take care of the rest. 
think we'd like Cartana to take care of the rest. Bender, come on out. There's some like horrible lag going on, guys. Absolutely disgusting. Look at that lag. That lag is so nasty. Alright. I'm gonna go for a smart strike. Boom! Seeing as he left his... Toxapex in on Amolga. Oh, no. He's still... He's gonna rally. Alright. This thing's got flamethrower. Is what's killing me. <sighs> Mostly have this in the bag. Alright, we're gonna see Flamethrower. It's going to Mako. I don't want to get burned. Because I think this is a physical Celestelia. If it was specially defensive, we wouldn't have done that much damage with. Oh! And we lose connection. I'm still gonna upload that because Emolga did so much work. Oh man, Emolga was a monster. We're still connected, so it must have been on Gold's end, which is fine. I don't think he, he rage quit because it seemed like he was having some uh, server lag. Oh, I'm glad we got to show Emolga off though. All right, woo! Uh, next week I'm bringing in a Lolan Golan Golem team, uh, so be sure to check that out and make sure you subscribe and leave a like if you like this content and you want to see more of it. My name is Sparrows. I'm going to head out. Take care.